take some time to remember who you are and who has done it before. But the other key with his Ochens is that he's most of his life. And he said yesterday at the weigh-ins that he is finally 100% healthy. And he lacked the shape. Pedro Hizzo enters into the M1 global ring with a night. That's the rock, man. Fedor Emelianenko. The beloved icon here. And everybody knew it. They weren't just the number one. You know, they forget, man. This is somebody you once called G-O-D inside. He was released from Strike Force after those three losses. Back here, an M1 retirement before uh, after he, he lost to Bigfoot Silva if it's God's will he will retire his brother Alexander in the audience to watch the last emperor walking to the M1 ring possibly for the last time he has had for 37 it's intimidating man like you just can't get him out of his can't get him out of his game you know stone stare from a man who when he's outside of the ring has a smile like a young child and the Russian fans acknowledge Fedor's entrance into the M1 Global Ring. Hero. M1's own Maria Zaikina to present the National Anthem. The special attraction fight between Brazil's Pedro Hizzo and Russia's Fedor Emelianenko. The man who had a nine-year unbeaten streak, Fedor Emelianenko, considered by many, comes out in the short black and delivers a kick to the ribs of Hizzo. Pedro's eyes, I mean, direct jab lands. Follows it with the hook. These, you're exactly right, Jeff. The more he, I mean, it's, this is impressive. Yeah. Hizzo has some hit now. Yeah, you know, the age bit. Too much go. thinking. You're waiting for that perfect shot. And big right. And Hizzo is down. That is, oh, Fabor Millianenko with a thunderous knockout. Fedor Emelianenko 
Falco knocks out Pedro. That was that was some impressive. That was some impressive power. That was he was staring directly at you, Pedro. I love you to death, son. You know what a shot. What a fight. I never seen something so tense. I mean, you could you think a little too much. An embrace and kiss from his wife and daughter. The 15 year anniversary show in November. I can tell you this, they're gonna watch. And let's make it official. Ladies and gentlemen. the crowd he said thank god we won this is our victory an embrace from the russian president the family together and What an incredible night here in St. Petersburg as the last emperor is successful in his return to the ill ring with an incredible knockout of the veteran Pizzo. Did it in dramatic fashion from Fedor Emelianenko. The jab, Rizzo, and then the last emperor ended it with that right hook, and then the left, and that was all. Right behind the ear, that's that's a hard spot to defend. It's a you can't you don't really recover from it, and he didn't. Once Hizo was down. Fedor pounced, finished it as he's done so many times before. It's just something ring, and we were very fortunate to be a part of this. He acknowledges his opponent, hate his open. Now, that's one nobody asked. With Pedro. Very true. That's the one I'm thinking about. 39 years old, 38 years old, excuse me. The Russian president, Vladimir Putin.